Hello lovelies and welcome to the HVAC Diaries. My name is Jessica and I'm a refrigeration and air conditioning apprentice in British Columbia, Canada. I work with my dad and my brother at Cam Cool Refrigeration and together we do commercial and light industrial refrigeration and air conditioning. Today is Friday, December 10th and this is my weekly vlog. Fantastic, you guys. And it is absolutely no coincidence that I went back to the gym this week. I don't know why, but the last couple of months, I just couldn't get myself to the gym for reasons. And I finally went back. I went four days this week, and suddenly, magically, everything in my life that was giving me trouble or worrying me or stressing me out suddenly is gone. So, I'll leave you with that thought. Highlights of my work week were helping my dad and my brother install a walk-in cooling system on a, a brand new catering truck. Everything's so shiny and just covered in plastic still. We've done a few of these now, and I really think my dad was very excited about this job because he kind of took the reins on the whole thing. He, he did the whole thing and I was just there to help. Uh, but yeah, so earlier in the week we mounted the indoor unit, the evaporator, we mounted the outdoor unit, the condensing unit, we ran the line set between the indoor and outdoor. Including the liquid line solenoid valve and the filter dryer and the side glass and obviously the TXV inside of the evaporator. Uh, and then we finished the job off later in the week. Actually today, it's Friday. Today we finished off the electrical. and installed the thermostat and, and commissioned the unit and it's all very exciting when we finally get it going and it's blowing cold air on you magically like oh it's so awesome i think tuesday was probably my favorite day because i overcame a challenge all by myself i was sent to replace a blower motor an ecm motor out of a air handler and if you've ever replaced one of these motors, it can either go really well or it can go really bad really quickly. So I spent the night worrying about this job. I chewed off my fingernails, um, but everything went really well, luckily for me. The blower came out of the unit. I was able to get the squirrel cage off really easily. The only thing that gave me a hard time was the belly bend. and it's probably because I didn't have the right tools. I was using two adjustable wrenches instead of the proper tools, but there are reasons for that as well. But it all went super well and I got it all done to like put it all together. And now I feel like a superstar. I felt invincible on Tuesday, like nothing can stop me now. Yes, I know it's just a blower mode. <laughs> Wednesday was another solo day for me. I was off on my own while my dad and my brother took care of some other jobs. I had an easy peasy day. I just had to change filters at two locations. One at a liquor store where I change on a monthly basis. I have to fold the, uh, the filter in half. Like this brand new filter, I've got to fold it in half so that I can get it into the space, um, into the unit. And then I replaced filters at a doggy daycare. I replace these filters every eight weeks instead of quarterly.
On Thursday, we had an emergency urgent call to our meat supplier. Their main walk-in freezer was down, stopped working, compressor didn't start. And what we found when we got there was somebody actually bumped the high pressure switch. Later that day, we went to an office where I replaced a Pro 8000 thermostat with a little T4 thermostat. And that's basically my week. Catering truck, blower motor, thermostat, a couple of other things. And before I go, I just wanted to mention again, the gym. I love, love going to the gym before work, getting my workout in, because it sets me up for the rest of the day. I have a routine, I get up at a certain time, I drink a certain amount of water, I do a certain thing, and I love the routine of it. I also just love the loud, awesome music I listen to before I go to work. It's a stress relief, I come back feeling just good and for the rest of the day I can manage my stress and my reactions and my frustrations because we all know HVAC is full of those. Yes it is. Well I'll leave it there. Thank you again for joining me on this episode of the HVAC Diaries for my weekly vlog. I hope you guys have a wicked ass weekend. Can I say ass on YouTube? Anyway, have a wicked weekend and I will see you all next week for my next vlog. Units are always super easy to access. The shaft came off the, um, the cat!